Hello and welcome to another Hire Em On YouTube joint. Uh, today we're going to be discussing at least my strategies in terms of playing the OG Reloaded map. Um, first of all, obviously it's so much loot in this uh, in this mode. There's no way of not having uh, a good loadout or a decent loadout going into it unless you drop on another squad. I think right here we went to Pleasant Park, uh, which you have an advantage obviously if you've played the OG maps if you've been playing for a while you already know where all the chests are and like they all spawn so it's not a situation where you come in and they're oh no there's no chest here no they all spawn everywhere all the spawn spots that were in the OG map everywhere you go there is a, a, a chest there uh, so you're gonna get and I want to say they actually added some chests in areas that aren't usually even there like I already know there's a chest in this garage I knew there were three upstairs. Sometimes you would come here and there might be one upstairs and only one in this garage. There's one in the garage, I want to say, almost always spawned, if I'm not mistaken. I don't think I ever rarely went in there and that chest wasn't there. And there's usually one in the basement of this house. Um, you usually can hear it. Sometimes there's a chest there. And there's definitely one upstairs, but there's always one downstairs. So. Again, in this mode, um, if you've played the OG maps or if you played back in the day, back in 2017, 2018, you remember uh, a lot, which definitely works to your advantage uh, in this mode. Um, but once again, so let's let's look at what's going to happen, right? So you got, uh, I think, 40 people, 40 people uh, all together or 50 all together. And so you have to survive, obviously, to the end. Um, so there's going to be some strategies in that. To me, I feel like do not go completely nuts dropping you know, like dropping down just because you do reboot in this mode. But if your team gets swallowed up, okay, completely swallowed up, then 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 your game's over, right? You just play, so that's the end of it. Someone from your squad has to stay alive. Uh, so in this situation here, I know this guy is uh, he's going to shoot somebody. Someone's coming down. I see about four footprints. So we take this guy out. I got two more footprints. This guy's here. I know there's one more coming down the stairs. Okay, we get him, and then we're, we're kind of done with that, right? Um, so, and then I think, I want to say a crown popped out somewhere there, right? I think one of my teammates picked up a crown. So that's three eliminations right there. But obviously the danger isn't over because when they respawn, they're going to respond close. So right now, my team is down. And you see, you're the last teammate standing. So here's what you don't want to do. You're the last teammate standing. You do not want to start running out there and going crazy. I have a few seconds left before someone gets rebooted, okay? And then I can run out. But what my plan is to let this team who just we just killed come back. And we're gonna chill. So right now I got 12 seconds before my other teammate comes back. And I also have Panther Brothers that's already up. So we're gonna relax. I don't know these people. This was just a random game with some random players, right? This guy came in the door, scared the hell out of me. Then Mr. Peapod came in, right? I'm not sure that's what we call him. That's what I'm calling him, Mr. Peapod. Um, and so we're gonna relax a little bit, right? I'm, I'm kind of holding fast in this area. And we're, we're done. We're going to get those eliminations, get the kills up, and that's great. And then we're going to go head on out of here. I'm not sure what's wrong with this guy. Maybe his controller died. That happens. Um, so, long story short, I eventually get knocked. And so now I'm watching my teammates. Now, there, I still got two teammates up. Me and the uh, my other uh, uh, teammate are down. We're waiting to be reloaded. So this is also something I think is a good strategy is to keep an eye out for who's going where. So I see my teammate down here, he's, he's doing Miles Morales, he's doing them dirty, and I mean dirty. So I respond, and I'm immediately gonna go to that area, right? I see the storm, the storm doesn't hit that bad in this mode, it's not that big of a deal. So I'm gonna go and go right to that guy that he knocked, and I'm assuming that he did not finish it, he did not. So boom, let's take out Mr. Miles Morales, let's get his loot. Because you might not come back with the best loot, right? You come back with one gun. I think you get an AR, basic black and white AR. I call it black and white, but it's just common, right? And then you don't really want to run around with that. So try to see where your teammates are doing, which is cool that they'll let you see it, so that you can kind of know where to land, where to come back to, and so that you can kind of get that smoke. So when you come back, you got a little something to work with. You got some minis maybe. 
you got a, you know maybe some uncommon weaponry uh, maybe maybe even legendary you never know a lot of times people knock people they leave them right they just let them go I want to get that loot but I see he has a teammate over there I'm a little low already because my aim was a little bit trash uh, popping that guy over the map the storms pushing me in I gotta go I don't have any heals I'm not exactly by my teammates they're posted up to the right there's no communication because you know it's just random people I'm gonna try to see if I can get them uh, doesn't really work out well I didn't have enough health to try to pop them but he takes me out no problem I'm gonna reboot but again watch what I do right here right so how much time I have left I think 28 seconds before I get rebooted my team is actually doing a thing uh, we have like I don't know 23 kills already uh, I've only contributed six I'm not doing much but I'm doing what I can do right um, Consider the situation. This is a nice shot here. This guy comes up, pile, knocks him out. Great, great gameplay right there. Finishes them off. I'm on the way back. So I'm paying attention to the fact that this is where my teammates are at. I see a chest right here. I'm coming back to my teammates. Not once again, not really worried about the storm. Let's get some loot. I'm getting shot at. Let's drop down. Um, you know, and then there's some good communication that you get in this mode. Like a lot of people that play this mode understand how to play this mode. So you see, he, he dropped the minis. He's like, okay, take the minis. This is no communication. I don't know these people. Yet they, you know, they know. Like this mode, you get this a lot more than when you just play basic randoms. At least what I've noticed is that there are people that really know how to play this game. And they play it pretty well. Uh, you're not going to get it every time. But sometimes you will get it. Um, so right now, you know, I'm just going to heal up. Get a little ammo. Get popped. People are everywhere in this mode. You constantly got to have to be vigilant as to what people are doing at all times. You cannot just run around, stand out there in the middle of nowhere and think you're gonna be okay. You're going to get popped. And just like in the regular BR mode, snipers are definitely in this mode, rifles are in this mode. So if you're out there in the open, uh, you're gonna get hurt. So I come over here, I hear my teammate, he's swallowing up somebody, definitely getting swallowed. Uh, no one wants to get swallowed, pause. And so now, um, I'm, I'm just ducking around. I know there's one team left. I'm seeing there's only seven players. All four of us are up, so that means it's a team of three somewhere. I don't know where they're at. I'm a little tentative because I've been playing this all day, all day yesterday, and it was pretty sweaty. It was pretty horrific. Anyone's played this mode is either you love it or you hate it or you love it, and then you start hating it, whichever the case may be. It's pretty rough. Um, so I'm trying to get up. I'm having malfunctions here. I can't seem to get my... Uh, my, my bouncing to, to work and it didn't work right I almost bounced myself back into the storm but we get the dub anyway so that was fun and that's just my strategy of looking at it um, leave a comment let me know how you feel about it after you get your win in this mode you get this beautiful umbrella called the Rizbrella that's what's up or the Rizbrella I'm sorry I probably mispronounced it but either way it's nice so definitely play this mode get a dub get this umbrella and as always, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Hit the like button.